mando i miei amici. Tell your comrades that only a while may examine the invention up close to make their final adjustments. Yes, Captain. He travels by boat to see the mechanism now. <laughs> Give me their plans. You are the assassin, am I right? You must stop, Cesare. I will help you. Let me take you to them. Grazie. Join the table army, she said. As you were. Good pay. Now look at me. Capitano di questa barca di merda. Disappeared. A new stench, as if the old one was not foul enough.
Cesare find the worst task for me? Open the gate. For the watch!
Let's see if you can bite your master's head, shall we? Perdonatemi, Leonardo. Buongiorno, Ezio. It is time to pay a visit to Lucrezia's lover, Pietro. I've sent my men out to find him. Molto bene. Ezio, if I may... What is it? Someone warned Rodrigo to stay away from the castello. Machiavelli? Do you have proof? No. We must not be split apart by mere suspicion. The Borgia! Know the locations of our spies. Who told them? Maestro Machiavelli asked about our search for Pietro earlier today. Ezio? You do not believe Machiavelli has turned traitor. First the villa attack, then the castello, and now this. Yeah. He yeah. is behind it all. Yeah. What were you able to find out? 
Pietro is to be assassinated this evening. Cesare sent his butcher. Micheletto, the best killer in Roma. No one escapes him. Until tonight. Come on. Did you uncover information about Pietro? The man is an actor, and he is performing in a play stanotte. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Andiamo! What did you find out about Pietro? He is to be suspended from a cross. Micheletto will come for him with a spear. the plans. No! I will not! Stop! Stop! Where are the plans? Past the guards. In my house. It is the last one. And the machine? Uh, in the tower. On top of the fortress. Grazie.
first design was effective. Everyone who piloted one died. Several even exploded. But we know this one works. <laughs> Tend to craft more weapons. Leonardo, you will help me stop them. Cesare must know of this! Dio, amigo. Ezio, news has spread that all my inventions have been destroyed. The disarray allowed me to work on something just for you. What is this? A new device to drift slowly from any height. It is not as cumbersome as my flying machine. You can take it everywhere. Grazie, Leonardo. Where is Pietro? I cannot tell you. But Micheletto waits at the city gate east of the Terme di Traiano. He intends to disguise his men to make the killing look like an accident. He will lead me to Lucrezia's lover. Ezio, Machiavelli has betrayed us. We would both wish to deny it, but the truth is now clear. Do what needs to be done. If you don't, I will. Without Volpe's thieves, I may require the help of my recruits. Please, I have done nothing. Francesco Trocchi. Dear friend, would I lie to you? You told your brother about my war plans in Romagna, who contacted the ambassador of Venezia. It was an accident. I am still your servant and ally. Are you demanding that I discount your actions and rely on friendship? I am asking, not demanding. To unite Italia, I must have every institution under my control. And if the church does not fall in line, I will eliminate it entirely. You know that I really work for you, not the Pope. Ah, but do I, Troche? There's only one way I can know that unconditionally now. You intend to kill me? Your most loyal friend? Of course not. Are you letting me go? Thank you, Cesare. You will not regret... <laughs> Guards! Give Micheletto the costumes for the play. Lucrezia is mine. No one else shall have her. 
Make doubly sure it is done correctly. I obey, Cesare. Oh, yes. Dumb Francesco's body in the Tevere. Once you get dressed, you follow me to the play. Capito. Tieni. Hey, you. Hold for the watch. That, that was sure. a bit like... Aspect un momento. Once you get dressed, you follow me to the play. Capito. This is for you. Once you get dressed, you follow me to the play. Capito. Il tuo costume. I seek Pietro. He acts on stage, Signore. One of my men will take you to him. Don't forget, I wear the black shirt. Protect me and wait for pilot call to the Centurion to strike. I must get to Pietro before he does.
My God, my God, why hast thou thus forsaken me? Merda, which cross is Pietro's? Hark, hark how he crieth upon Elijah to deliver him. Wait and we shall see whether Elijah dare come here or not. My thirst is great. My thirst is great. Yea, thou shalt drink no more. Heart bleed. Let us see what thou wilt say. Now, Longius, take this spear in hand. Yes! Have the spear and take a good heed. Thou must do as the bishop bade thee, a thing that is full of great need. I will do as he bade me. But on your peril it shall be. What I do, I may not see whether it be evil or good. Hi, King. I need to of get on stage. I Have ye to slay this man that I here see dead, hanging, that never yet did a miss? For surely God's son is he. Therefore a tomb is made for me, therein his body buried shall be. For he is king of bliss. Sir Joseph, I say surely, this is God's son almighty. Go ask Pilate for his body. And buried shall he be. I shall help thee to take him down devotedly. Sir Pilate, special I be pray a boon thou grant me as thou may. This prophet that is dead today, thou grant me his body. Already, in good faith, if that Saint Dorian says that he is dead, him will I not deny. Ha! <laughs> you cannot say, Pietro. The wine he drank was poisoned. As I promised Cesare, I made doubly sure. I am not yet dead. I did not come here to kill you. He who is the cause of someone else becoming powerful is the agent of his own destruction. Cut him down. This was not in rehearsal. Hold up the guards. Help! 
Ambrosio! We are here to help! Stop the guards! I've got to get No need to be shy. Come forward. He's been poisoned. That power. Cantarela. Drink this. Hurry! Give him a moment. I feel slightly better. Leeches will lead to a full recovery. I cannot thank you enough. I... The key to the Castel Sant'Angelo. Now. What are you talking about? I'm simply a poor actor. Cesare knows about you and Lucrezia. Here. Stop! Wait for us! We thought you had been killed, Sir Ezio. Not yet. Where does this passage lead? To the north, outside the walls. Let me through. I must go help the troops. Un momento. You were at the Villa Auditore during the attack. Oh, get him! There! There! A new tide to the declared defenses and the army of the people. Why did you run? I. You are the traitor, not Machiavelli. Long live the Borgia! Merda! I was right. I have to stop La Volpe before he gets to Machiavelli. I have discovered the traitor. What? One of our men. He was at the villa attack. Here. He carried his letter. My God. This is good news. More than you know. I am once again in your debt, Ezio. What debt is there amongst friends who trust one another? Yes. Thank you for relaying the message in time. Come, Niccolò. It has been far too long since we've talked. I heard the Colosseum Passion Play took an unexpected turn this evening. Really? It seems Jesu Cristo was... resurrected three days early. Volpe, how goes Roma? Very well, Ezio. The French and Papal forces are in disarray. Then it is almost time. Call the assassins together. And bring Claudia. Now? Yes. La Ashaya Wakton Mutlak, Bel Kulun Mumkin. The wisdom of our creed is revealed through these words. We work in the dark to serve the light. We are assassins. Claudia, we here dedicate our lives to protecting the freedom of humanity. Mario, our father, and our brother once stood around this fire, fighting off the darkness. Now, I offer the choice to you. Join us. You and I have not seen eye to eye on many issues. Niccolò! But you are exactly what the Order needed. You have led the charge against the Templars and rebuilt this brotherhood. Now we must put Ezio where he belongs. At the head of the Assassins. Ezio Auditore da Firenze. You will now be known as Il Mentore, the guardian of our Order and our secrets. Where other men blindly follow the truth, remember, nothing, nothing is, is true. true. Where other men are limited by morality and law, remember, everything, everything is, is permitted. Why 
had this sudden change of heart. I have always stood by you. I was the one who brought you to Roma, and the one who caused the explosion as you fled the castello. The mercenari who protected you at Il Colosseo were mine as well. You just did not know it. Maestro Machiavelli! Cesare has returned to Roma alone! He rides for the Castel Sant'Angelo! Grazie. Well? The decision is yours, not mine. Niccolò, you better not stop telling me what you think. Why else would I seek the opinion of my most trusted advisor? Go kill them, Mentore. Finish what you started. Good advice. I intend to write a book about you one day. If you do, make it short. <laughs>